Right, so we're back with these two dingus, and uh, I'm going to mind read them, even though they're clearly grave robbing. Whose idea was this? Yours, I'd presume, or his. At least it'll make a good story later. What? Alright, well, I don't know why you tell people you're a grave robber. That seems like a kind of a shit idea, to be honest, but... Let's see what they're robbing. Oh! Oh! Uh-oh. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> hey, kid. Who was the hero? My great-grandfather. I found a bunch of his things from the war in the attic. I even had a drink from his flask. No one in the family ever talks about him, though. I think it's because of his gory stories of the war. It must have been great to stick someone with a bayonet or paint a wall with someone's brains. Trust me, kid. Stuff like that stays with you forever. You only find yourself wishing to forget. So what? He was a hero. I'd do anything to be remembered like that. Instead, people think I'm a coward who committed suicide. I'm sorry, kid. I didn't do it. I don't know how it happened, but I'm no coward. And if I were still alive, I'd slit the throat of every person who ever called me one. Okay, okay, touchy subject. I get it. Really, I'm <clears throat> not interested, dude. Oh, God damn. Uh, oh, it's one of those things. Oh, man. Alright, well, we'll avoid that, I suppose. Let's just move on. Find this uh, drowned girl. Oh, no, not drowned. Whatever. Maybe. Anything in here? No. Oh yeah, cool. Okay. Hello. Hey, I don't know what you're doing, but... Finally, it's about time they sent someone. Look, I think you got the wrong guy. Who were you expecting? Who's supposed to maintain this place? I mean, just take a look around. These aren't just rocks, they're reminders. No one else may care, but I refuse to just let mine crumble away. I refuse to be forgotten. Right. Well, good luck with that. <laughs> wow, nice reaction. To what is an understandable uh, gripe, but all right. The fuck is going on there? Here we are in the oldest part of the graveyard, which was founded in the 1660s. Was that before or after the trials? Oh, good question. Did everyone hear that? This young lady just asked if this happened before or after the famous trials. It actually happened a few decades before, so this graveyard is quite old. Okay, and we're going to walk a little farther now. So if you'll just follow me. Um, I have a few questions. Would they really be doing a tour in a town where there's an active murderer running around in the graveyard where there's already been a murder? I don't think they'd be too happy about that, to be honest. Hey, buddy. You got a problem? You could say that. I used to be a butcher before this bitch got a bug up her ass and started snooping around. People used to come from miles away to buy from me. I had more awards than the wall space to hang them. Then, her little boy goes missing, and I'm suddenly on death row? Call it a hunch, but I'm guessing you killed him. I never killed him. I never killed any of them. I left that up to my pigs. So you're just gonna haunt her for the rest of her life? Then what? Simple. I'm gonna ask her how her son tasted. Funny thing about pigs. You'd be surprised at how much their diet can affect their flavor. I hear there's a special place out there reserved for monsters just like you. Evidently not. Um, wow, what an asshole. I felt a chill. Was it a ghost? 
Yes. There's so much more than witches in this town. It's so peaceful now. But some terrible things happened to these people. Yeah, not too long ago, actually. Really, really not too long ago. <laughs> it's kind of surprising that you're doing this tour. Unless they're doing it like... Well... I don't know. The fuck? Alright. Um... Oh. Can I collect that? Or is that just... No, that's just chilling. Alright. Yellow Fever Memorial Plaque. Okay. Quarantine? I think there's a bit of story that I was not paying attention to here. Or is about to be explained to me. Maybe. Hello. Who's <laughs> Good question. Ah, uh, yes. That was just a sacrifice in the name of science. <laughs> Flesh sacrifice? Sounds more like voodoo than science. Some may call it that. But they forget the true purpose of science. To understand the world around us and all the forces that govern it. Just because the research may be unsavory at times, doesn't mean we should turn a blind eye. Besides, now I've got plenty of specimens to work with. You experimented on these people? Most of them are as good as dead anyway. I save the ones I can. The rest are being put to good use. Those were people, not guinea pigs. You're right. Now, if you don't mind, I'm quite busy. <laughs> oh, wow, what a fucking asshole. Why is everybody from this town a complete douchebag? For the most part. Dr. Trotter, eh? Wow. All right. I was going to make some quip about Pony Falls and Horses, but I just, I'm not, I'm not witty enough. Hello. Why were all those people sick? I, I, I think it's yellow fever. I, I overheard the nurses talking about it. Something about the, the people working on the Panama Canal. <coughs> <coughs> They must have brought it back with them. Please. She is sick ghost. You can't die here. They'll use me for his experiment. <coughs> also, how long ago was this? What do you mean? This was a hospital. They were trying to help you. Can't you see? <coughs> this was a quarantine. No help is coming. Yeah, I did see that. <laughs> mm, sick ghosts, everybody. It happens. Right, I guess I can't get through any of that because it's all ghosty stuff. Um, yeah. Nope. Oh. Look, I'm on your side. I just want to ask you a few questions. Why can every friggin' ghost teleport but me? I'm gonna have to figure this shit out. <laughs> wow. Aw, oh, developers. You... <sighs> you... I like that. They, uh, they, they know what I'm thinking. Move the marker, blah, blah, blah. Oh, wow. Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> Uh, I haven't been able to do that the whole time, I hope. That would fucking piss me off, kind of, but... I don't know. Come here, ghosty. Even past stuff. Ah. Oh, fuck! This explains a lot. Ah, uh, right. I, there's an area I need to go back to now, because I spent far too much time pissing around, like, trying to get this item... Uh, 
if you did watch, and I feel sorry for you if you did, uh, the episode, and you, you'll know what I'm referencing. There's this fucking platform, this, uh, oh, what's it called? Um, that is a gramophone, yes. Oh, uh, there's a balcony that I really needed to get to, to pick up an item, I think, to solve a murder or something. I was a helper ghost, and I could not get up there for the life of me. I was like, how the fuck? So if I can do that, then that explains a lot. Okay, alright, I should get out of here. Have I just gone back the same way? Or... I think I have, haven't I? Yep. Oh, up there. That'll do it. Uh, okay. Collect Julia's vaults. Don't know why they'd be here, but alright. Um... Am I missing something? Ah. Just hold on, will you? Ooh, more stuff to collect potentially. More time to waste. Or I could actually just go up that way. Oh, okay. Now. Oh. Right. Hopefully we'll get another little story from those things. Because I have collected a fair few of them. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Whee! I uh, don't think there was anything else. Unless there was one down here. There is not. Let's go. Okay, that's a pretty cool mechanic. I like it. Oh god. What? Seriously? The amount of shit going on in this fucking graveyard the night of a murder. Because remember. Oh shit. Year over. So many deaths, but likely many more yet to come. I can't help but believe this graveyard will only get more full. Who knows? Um. I got a bit cut off there. Ah, controls. Do you want to work? Um, I, I cannot believe there's so many people around and about on the night of a murder. Also, check out this fucking ghost. Are some of the tortured souls, the screaming phantasms from this town's past, still haunting this graveyard? Screaming phantasms? Travis, don't you think that's a little over the top? Okay, cut. Dwayne, how many times have I told you, don't correct me on camera? But you can't say that on the show, man. People will laugh. Oh, hell. People come to the show for over the top. Okay, sorry. <laughs> ah, commentary. All right, roll it. Travis the Trapper here, and we're in Salem. Now, as you know, since there's such a Contact violent place, place, there's likely to be a... It would help if you knew what you were talking about. <laughs> How could he possibly know what he's talking about? He's talking about I fucking think. ghosts. That's how more tough on this day. Hello? Oh, he's got the moonlight behind me. Wait! It's over there now! <laughs> oh, I think I just missed some funny dialogue there. Right, and before I start another cutscene up... Um... We haven't really progressed very much, but I, I got my new ability! Swoosh, swoosh! Fucking awesome. Um... So yes, we will find this ghosty girl, um, who apparently can't talk because she just goes blah 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 at me. So, yeah. Uh, 